Some chose to celebrate the Labor Day holiday by speeding down the Susquehanna River in Lock Haven. Today was the final day of the Lock Haven Regatta, a powerboat racing competition. Newswatch 16's Chris Keating was there to capture all of the sights and sounds. The sounds of powerboats on the west branch of the Susquehanna River echoed across the city of Lock Haven on Labor Day. The holiday marks the final day of racing for the Lock Haven Regatta. The event attracts hundreds of people. We usually come every year and, and we're cousins, so we usually hang out a lot here every, every time of year. Really good. It's been really hot. Racers from all over the country come here to compete. However, Chloe Whitmoyer of Turbotville didn't have to travel far. She competed all day long. I run three different classes. My slowest boat is probably 52, 55, and my faster one is 60. She said clear and sunny skies added to a fun racing weekend. But the weather has been incredible. Um, usually at, at Lock Haven, it's, uh, well, it's an annual event, and usually we get rain at least one day, but three days of gorgeous weather. The wind fortunately has cooperated, so it's been great. Ed Donnelly has been competing at the regatta for more than 15 years. Due to medical reasons, he couldn't this year. So he is volunteering his time to work the event. Uh, keeping an eye on all the boats that are out there, the wind conditions, anything else that might be going, a piece of floating wood can send one of these boats into deep, deep trouble. The Lock Haven Regatta also features a festival with live music and food on East Water Street. Many people came here to get refreshing drinks to beat the summer heat. Getting slushies and 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 um, getting some um, cool air. I have gone through more Gatorade water than I think I've ever gone through in my lifetime. Uh, and to tell you the truth, the afternoons, the shade came in, a little bit of a breeze, but I wouldn't trade it for the world. Event organizers say they hope they can get this weather again for the 53rd edition of the Lock Haven Regatta next year. Chris Keating, Newswatch 16, Clinton County.